Caroline, the frugal grocery girl, and welcome to week 21 of my $25 grocery challenge. Because I overspent last week, the budget this week is $22.07. Before I get into my meal planning, I'd like to show you the last dumpster dive video haul I did. It will be the last one for a while, but it's a good one. A cold, rainy Sunday dumpster dive. This is probably going to be the last dumpster dive haul video for a while. Um, it was really cold this weekend, and I actually had just checked this, this dumpster yesterday, and there was nothing. So uh, this morning, there was all this stuff in it. So let's get into it. Uh, pork chops chicken breast tenders, four Angus sirloin steaks with a sell-by date tomorrow. So interesting, see 513, interesting. Um, salmon, this was also very cold. Two peppers, these were um, in a three pack, but uh, one of them was bad. Package of sweet pop tomatoes, a bag of red onions and they're perfectly fine. There was a bag of lemons. One was, um, or two of them were bad, but uh, these are all great. An entire bag of limes and they're all fine. And finally, two chocolate bars. So I think I'm all set up with the meats for a while. And as I said, probably the last dumpster dive video for for some time. Happy Sunday! Here are the main ingredients I'll be using this week. For breakfast, Greek yogurt or oatmeal. For snacking, I have apples and nuts, lots of carrots. And over here from the freezer, I have frozen chicken thighs that are defrosting now. And I saw this video recipe for chicken shawarma it looked amazing and I have all of the ingredients except for a certain kind of pepper so I'm going to try making it. I've never had it before but uh, it looked delicious and I'm thinking with the chicken shawarma to make some wraps using red lentils and I can also make some kinds of like poke bowls with quinoa adding chickpea, um, peppers, red onions, veggies, maybe some cabbage, etc. Okay. And of course I have salad stuff. And if needed, I can make some tuna fish. So with the $22.07 that I am able to spend this week, I'm going to make a list, go shopping, and when I get back, I'll show you everything I bought and how much I spent. And I'm back from shopping. I went to two stores. First off, Lidl, a pound of butter, $3.69. The smallest red cabbage I could find there at 98 cents a pound, this was $2.58. A quart of half and half, $2.79 and a pound of sliced Swiss cheese on sale for $2.99. Over at ShopRite, I got sour cream for $1.49 on sale and a 33.8 ounce container of olive oil for $8.88. It was on sale, and yes, I bought olive oil last week, but after Googling why the price has gone up so significantly, I, I discovered that there have been back-to-back bad harvests uh, along with I guess some other issues so I decided to stock up so the total of everything here came to twenty two dollars and forty two cents my budget was twenty two dollars and seven cents so I am over budget by thirty five cents this week I will apply that to next week and by then I should be all caught up thank you so much for watching Feel free to leave comments below and I will see you next week.